Good driving, Nikki. I thought I was gonna be checking out for sure. How'd they find us? I thought that we went through all this trouble so no one would know. I don't know. These diamonds are serious. Anyone who heard of them would want them. I ain't surprised we got a bit of attention. You want me to take the ice to Raiden? Nah, me and Tony will look after them. Sort them out from the trash. I sure hope we ain't lost any on the route. Things got shaken up pretty good back there. They sure did, Luca. Here's hoping we can find them all. See you around, Nikki. Luca and this crew have got the stuff, Ray. It's all in the back of the truck. You keep an eye on them. They didn't pull nothing? I don't know, Ray. You don't trust them? Then wear the ice. And we'll catch you around. Hey, Cam! I need this. They Poseidon swallow you whole. the campaign going. Mike, it's just fantastic. We're making a difference by giving the networks millions of dollars to run campaign ads. It's democracy at a grassroots level. Fundraising is going really well. I haven't sold myself out at all. I've learned a lot being an actor, you know, on the set during years of business. I want to bring the reality of TV dramas from the lots of Vinewood to our state. Wow, look at that. The phones are exploding. Line three, Sarah. Hi, Mike. I'm a huge fan and a committed swinger. Maybe you'd like to come to one of our parties. Hi, Brandon. I love that art house film you made when you painted a picture with your junk. John, I'm a concerned parrot. How are you going to help me make the world safer for my kids? Well, Sarah, if you vote for me... Oh, hi, Luis. Wow, what a coincidence. <laughs> hey, Margo, how are you? What are you doing here? I was just, just meeting someone. A date, actually. A Hercules? It, it's a gay club. You never answered my calls. Yeah, I'm sorry. Or my emails. Yeah, I meant to, I'm just... Fucking rude. Yeah, <laughs> look, I got a lot going on. Did you get the book I sent you? No. The flowers? No, li listen, Margo, you you're a nice girl, and, and it was nice hooking up with you, but it, it was over a year ago. What's time got to do with anything? It's, it was a long time ago. I mean, it's time to move on. You're pathetic. You know that? You think you're such hot shit, don't you? <laughs> no, I'm more like cold shit. But, but seriously, I just don't want to marry you. And no matter how many letters you send me, or chocolate bunnies, or skywriting my name, or naming stars after me, or whatever. It's nothing personal. <laughs> no, rejection never is personal. You know, my dad was right about you. Your dad? Uh, look, he probably was, okay? But if you'll excuse me, I, I gotta go. You, you can't go. <sighs> but, but I can go. You can't. I'm going to die. I just took 37 painkillers and 15 sleeping pills. There, there's the bottle. I'm going to die, and it's all your fault. Oh, yeah, pero tú sí que eres loca. I'll be dead soon. Either get me to the hospital, or I'm dead. You fucking idiot. You're going to the hospital, you idiot. Shit. Oh, fuck. I thought I'd just pass out. The revolution. Prepare to be revolted. You've worked hard all your life. <laughs> Finally I think I can feel my heart breaking, baby. Oh, dumbass. That's such a liver fail. <coughs> the classics. 97.8. Is getting your stomach pumped icky? <coughs> Kiss me, baby. The only thing going near that mouth is a tube for the stomach pump. <coughs> Some hair of the dog with... 100 yards. I'm slipping away. Hold me, Luis. Hold on to yourself, bitch. It would be really convenient if you died on me. I was real stupid, wasn't I? Now you're starting to understand. Thank you. Yards. Turn left. Get 
in there. You're the doctor's problem now. Aren't you coming in? You could hold back my hair when they pump me. I see enough bulimic bitches at the club, Margo. You're on your I own. I love you. They tread like concrete. Can't find them things in the mic. Then tell me the bad, but they take me around three. Run them bust me. Then they got me. Then I pop me. Then I pop me. Then they sound of me. When they let off me. If you see them in the corner, scatter with the rabbit for them. Run them bust me. When they let me. I'm so lovely. When they dig up me. Run the shot off me. When they bust off me. Chains and ages. Oh, you know my name. They say the contract is like a bomb drop. Package is delivered, Jacob. Thanks, Nico. And I'd be real happy to start. We give you more work if you want more work. <laughs> Hey, have you a light? Hey, sorry, Papi, I don't smoke. Ah, a Spaniard, wonderful, a man of culture. I'm not <laughs> sure someone from the heist qualifies as being Spaniard, but whatever. Oh, exactly, whatever, whatever you say, Daddy. Excuse me? What is wrong with you? The British, they give you this beautiful, if a little awkward language, and you just debase it with whatever, or like, or fuck you, or get over yourself. In that <laughs> case, fuck you. Oh, c'est ça, oh, va te faire foutre. Oh, who am I to complain? My country is not much better. We are the worst. My people watch American television and then they complain about it afterwards. Oh la la, I am rich! Uh, time was when we would chop someone's head off and we would run around the street with it on a stick. Vive la France! Now, we are soft and miserable just like you. Hey, I'm not miserable. Well, then clearly you do not watch enough television. <laughs> you enjoy the, the bright lights and the big cities and the hope that maybe one day you become rich and stupid and, and your people. Maybe you can make a nice little TV show with you and your friends. Hey, knowing my friends, I hope not. <laughs> well, I do not come to Liberty City uh, to watch television. I come to fuck and get high. What else is there? Well, I don't know, family? I had a family. Meaningless. Honor? Psst. Don't make me puke. No, mon ami. I had to tell you, my friend. Nothing matters in this world apart from getting your rocks off. Or getting so out of it you don't realize you haven't got your rocks off. <laughs> I like a man who's so focused. <laughs> Have you got a car? I'm not sure I want to get into a car with someone like you. Oh, <laughs> relax, relax. Uh, let's go for a drive. I like you. Uh, you find things as, as ridiculous as me. I have an appointment at the Hyatt Massage Spa on Diamond Street. Can I buy a massage for you? Uh, it's the least I can do considering your many kindnesses. Nah, I'm cool, bro. I don't need no slave labor fluffing. I like things giving up willing. As you wish, but uh, there are pleasures distinct to the professional mistress. You may come to understand that in later years, uh, Spaniard. Yeah, okay, Frenchman. I love her! I need her! I see her! Yes, Thank you, Spaniard. I am only sorry you will not join me in this adventure. Don't catch nothing, bro. Jesse, what's up, man? Hey, boss. I'm just wondering when you think you're gonna do a shift at the club. This place could do with that Luis Lopez magic. I'll try to put some time in soon, man. Shit's been kind of crazy. Trust me. 
Look after things. Aquí está su cafecito. Gracias. ¿Quieres azúcar? No. Mami, soy yo. Ay, Luis. Hey, hijo, ¿quieres un cafecito? Sí, un chin. Un chin. Uh, Luis, this is Mr. Santos. What's going on? Hey, I guess I didn't recognize you from your mom not having any pictures of you up on the walls. Yeah, I guess she doesn't have any up. Now you mentioned it. I guess mugshots don't sit along too well with graduation shots. Hey, who the fuck are you? Well, it's complicated. Mr. Santos is a businessman. It's not that complicated when you think about it. You see, your mother here has been making that classic American mistake. In other words, she's been living beyond her means. Hey, bro, be polite when you talk about my mother, man. I'm being very polite. See, I like her. She's a good woman. If I ain't like her, I would have burned this building down by now. I mean, you know you could have came to me for money. But what would you do to get it? Yeah, I wouldn't borrow it for a piece of shit like this. Hey, be careful, kid. I could have you killed. Oh, I'm real scared of you, motherfucker. Huh? How do you sleep at night, man? Long talking to all women. Hey, 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 she called me, okay? It's business. We run a service. She knew the rules. She should have read the small print. You know, you really are a piece of shit. I'm a businessman, and trust me, it could get a lot worse, my friend. Now calm the fuck down. Your mother told me about you. Maybe you can help me pay off your mother's debt. That way, this building doesn't have to come to an unfortunate end. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's go. As always, nice to see you, Miss Lopez. Luis, be careful. Yeah, it's a bit rich coming from you. You ought not to judge me, Luis Lopez. You're just like your father. No need for transport. We're going somewhere close. You're gonna start fighting for money again. Sorry, bro, but I don't do that no more. I saw you go a few years back. Could have been something if you didn't care so much about that pretty face of yours. Thanks, but that ain't the reason I quit. You ain't quit no more. My thinking is you were bad enough for no one to notice when you take a dive. You beat the first two guys I set you up with. Then you fall on the third. Fuck, bro. Shit, bro. I sure didn't think I'd be coming back here again. Man, there's probably even some guys on the scene that still remember me. They ain't all fucked up by now. What if I get used to winning? Then your mama better get used to me coming around and not being my usual friendly self. So tough! 
Kicking the shit out of you. You buy no steroids. Come on, let's go. One. Come on. Harder. Don't leave yourself. Believe yourself. Hey, man. You know you did the right thing. Nice to see a man like you swallow his pride for his mama. Just stay the fuck away from him, okay? You got your money. We done. Listen to me. I was there for your mama when you weren't. I think you must have lost some brain cells in that fight. Yeah, if I see you again, I'll kill you, bro. I'm out. Hijo. I took a dive in that fight for you, mommy. You don't know that guy any more money. What do you mean you took a dive? You mean you lost? You claim to be some big shot, and you can't even win a fight for your mama? I lost a fight for you, mommy. I didn't ask you to lose no fight. I did not ask for losers in my family. You know what? Forget about it, ma. Just don't go borrowing any more money. See you soon. Hey, it's your favorite. 